Okay, so um, we are looking at this problem here that a student sent. So a student sent this problem, um, struggling with this problem. It's a typical problem about um, systems of um, linear equation, all right? So here we go. Here's a problem right here. Okay. Obviously, the student says I don't. Is saying I don't understand. We have all been there. So, um, a sugar company, sweet sugar company, will choose from two companies to transport its sugar to market. First company charges four thousand five hundred to rent trucks, plus an additional fee of one. $150.25 to charge for each uh, ton of sugar. Another company charges $4,194 plus for the truck, plus um, an additional fee of $175.75 for each ton of sugar. So it's important that we know what we are working with, all right? Uh, the easiest way, I think, to solve this problem is just to think of it as a system, as get two equations, two linear equations, y equals mx plus b in one case, and then y equals, um, say, nx plus c in another case. All right, so here we have the situation again. All right, so let... Um, let y equals the total charge. And let x equals the number of tons of sugar, right? So x is equal to the number of tons of sugar, right? That the company transports, right? So number of ton of sugar, trans tons of sugar transported. Okay. So All right, so now what we're trying to do is we're trying to make sense of this problem before we start solving it. If you graph this, if you, if you gather your information, the first company obviously pays a one-time fee, an initial fee of 4,000. Four, the first company rather charges an initial fee of $4,500 for the truck and then $150.25 per ton of sugar. Second company charges an initial fee of $4,194 and then $175.75 per ton of sugar. And so here we have the situation. So we want to find out when, for how much sugar would the companies cost the same? All right, so how many tons of sugar? And so the easiest way to think about it is if the Y is the cost in each case, and they, we are thinking about what happens when the Ys are the same, then that amounts to taking these two equations and setting them equal to each other without using the Y. So in other words, this right side here has to be equal to this right side here. So anyway, if we proceed and do that, what you'd find out is we would solve 4,500 plus 150.25x equals 4,194 plus 175.75x. And uh, let me just write the x's in here. Okay, these are x's. And so if you do that, you're going to solve for this um this equation right this is really a system so we're setting two equations equal to each other here and what you find out is that x would be 12. so for 12 tons of sugar transported the cost would be the same the charge would be the same from each company each company will be charging the same amount if you're transporting 12 tons of sugar you can see this in a graph if you make a simple graph you can see that when x is equal to 12 uh, the cost will be the same, which is slightly over uh, $6,000.